Hey, it's your boy Rocky. And it's Savon. And this is Bay or Boot. The reunion. Today we're going to have some of our bays and some of the contestants who got the boot come back. And we're going to do an update and just see how life's going and have any of them made a connection. Let's get it. You know I'm just... Young and from the city, yeah. Won't you come and see me, yeah. Pull up on you, meet me there. We can do this anywhere. Fuck shy, but I don't care. Let me tell you why, like, got you here. Girl, I do this now for real. So we're back with the crew from episode three. Let's bring out Shannon, right? I'm about to change. I'm about to change. change. Yeah, these niggas hating, talking about these niggas, please. please. Yeah, they probably mad, cause they bitchy trying to save me. Shannon, what's up? How you doing? Welcome back. Yeah, I'm back. So what's been going on since since the episode? Not much, just still chilling, still living a single life. You know? <laughs> <laughs> ah, so 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 what happened? You ain't you ain't find love? Nah, man, no love yet for me. Uh oh. So you you chose Shalandra. Yeah. So uh, just kind of give us some updates on on what happened after after well, the show. All I can say is, what well, she not here? She, she definitely, <laughs> Shalandra couldn't make it. <laughs> and I don't know if that's a giveaway or not. <laughs> but we actually do have Jewel here, so hey. Jewel, come on. Got a bad chick called Roxanne. Flew a plane, nigga, what you call that? Nigga what up, Tay? Think with the pink and my titties on the tongue. <laughs> oh, y'all. I will give y'all hugs and kisses and all that, but uh, I'm clumsy and I might ask them to spend my food on y'all. And y'all look too good today. <laughs> no, thank you. We appreciate that. No Can you tell us about your experience <laughs> at Bayer Booth, though? Well, my experience. <laughs> I was hurt. <laughs> I was bamboozled. Mm. And uh, I just, I needed some time to heal. Yeah. See? Shame Food has helped. Heart. You're a heartbreaker, man. That's what they tell me. <laughs> Got my meat falling. Look at that. You just lying. That's what they tell me. <laughs> Jesus. So, 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 I, I do follow you on Instagram, though. And oh. I see you've experienced a bit of a, a glow up since they are boo. Man, ever since I got that boot, though. I just want to say thank you, good. <laughs> you you I got that boot and I had to really just reevaluate myself. And sometimes... You have to reevaluate yourself. But I did, and I came to the conclusion that I needed to glow up and get flued out. Mm. <laughs> so yeah, I did the glued up part. Well, I glued it all up. I'm happy for you. So, do you feel like you made the best decision? I mean, I made a decision. But he didn't say best though. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, y'all told me I had to make one, so I made one. Nah, really. so but if he had more time, it would have been me. That's yeah. what I'm saying. That ain't what I'm saying. But oh. So what are you saying? What are you saying? I mean, I had two boots on my feet, but I just didn't choose them. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> you got you. Two boots on both feet, but he'd only choose one. <laughs> you can only go right, left, right. All right now. <laughs> How do you feel about your episodes after watching all the confessions? Uh, it was pretty good, pretty funny, pretty interesting, man. I thought that was going to do me bad, but hey, the did me bad and I thought it was going to do me bad. Joel, how do you feel? I felt like y'all knew that we needed to stay in a closed environment. Because if y'all would have took me outside with this hunk of thing right here, mm. I would have had to show up. Hey. You know, I would have had to put my fighting gloves on because I had elbow space. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> when inside, y'all use inside voice and stuff. You know what I'm saying? So I was trying to be good. But you try that again on another episode. <laughs> Man, I think uh, one thing we get a lot of feedback on is, is people are excited to hear from Tink with the pink, man. Mm. And her titties don't, don't touch. touch. Where, where did you get that from? That's Is that just for the nasty stuff? Or that is, that is, okay, so I do comedy. Jewel Goofy. Nobody believes my name is Jewel. And I'm really goofy. So I felt like it was perfect for me to name myself Jewel Goofy. Now, on the other end, for promoting myself, I thought, everybody's rappers these days, right? Let's call myself Tink with the pink. Mm. I'm Tink. I'm goofy. You know what I'm saying? People believe my name is Tink before they believe it's Jewel. You know what I'm saying? And with the pink, 
You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it don't pay. It's in one place. It's pink. You know what I'm saying? Take the whole bag. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Then, <laughs> it it whole don't whole touch. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? As a skinny girl with no boobs, I love to see women mm. that actually have boobs that actually, you know what I'm saying, can put it in nice blouses that don't overshow, you know, mm. cleaves and stuff like that. So it was like Tink with the Pink, but my titties don't touch. Mm. I felt like it was a perfect rapper name to promote myself in a petty, goofy way. Hey, Especially with my petty ass mixtape dropping soon. Hey, cop the petty mixtape, titties don't touch. You know what I'm saying? Dropping on SoundCloud. Her dollar going to general. You know what I'm saying? Coming to a hood near UC store. <laughs> so um, you still you still out here looking for love? You gonna you think you need another episode? To find you some base? I, th I think I need another episode. I think I think he need a shot at me. Oh, oh. Mm. do you deserve this? Mm. I mean, I ain't choose the person. Hey, okay, so we gotta work on this. <laughs> he gotta see what he gotta do. Cause he needs to see. <laughs> he got shit. What's up? <laughs> what you got? <laughs> Tink. Tink don't hurt nobody. <laughs> and with that being said, I guess we gotta go to, to episode number four. Let's get it. <laughs> Thank you. Shout out to our amazing sponsor, Chef Jarrett. What's Thank up? you so much for catering this yummy, <laughs> yummy food. So can cool. you tell us a little bit about your business? I can, I can. Uh, the, the Flaming Skillet is the name of my business. It's a, a catering brand. And um, basically we do meal prep. We um, um, do all types of catering events and, you know, banquets and whatever, personal chef type stuff. And um, actually, um, we are just launched our season two of my cooking show, uh, The Culinary Connoisseur. Um, so you can find that on YouTube, The Flame Skillet Show. Um, we have some some scenes from like some uh, like some background type footage of what we do. And like, in the catering world, you'll see you know me talking to some of the clients and stuff like that. So um, it's really cool. But uh, The Flame Skillet out of Dallas, Texas. Yeah. yeah. All right. So when you go see Chef Jerry, tell them that Bayer Boo sent you. Welcome back. Welcome back. This is Bayer Boo. And we're here with the season finale. Finale. Pass. So we're gonna bring back Scooter, Bam, and Bree. First up, Scooter. Scooter. So Scooter, you're back for your episode. You know, you was lit earlier. But tell us, how do you feel about your own episode? After all was said and done, you saw everything. How do you feel? This muscle right here. Yeah. Like, I'm the mediator. I'm, I'm, I'm running this muscle right here. I'm doing all the talking. So, yeah. I already know what's going on. Hey. So, it's cool to choose, choosing the bays and giving the boots. I'm telling you. How Excuse did you feel? How do I feel? No, being able to choose the bays. Oh, uh, okay. 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 Well, shoot. It, it gave me, you know, just a little, a little leeway. A, to just do some things a little different than how I was on the last show. Cause now, you know, it's basically like I, I got the throne, you know, and I'm passing it out, you know, so. I'm your king. <laughs> <laughs> For real though, so you know, so, you know. I mean, you know, it, it, it was good though, know, just as far as, you know, being able to pick instead of trying to be chose, like, you want to be yeah. picked. Like, don't so, pick me. I'm the don't pick me kind. So, like, don't pick me if I'm in the competition. So tell me how you, how did you feel about the uh, the contestants? How I feel about, shoot, they both nice though, for real. Like, I mean, they both had their own little different attributes about themselves, but you know, hey, they both was cordial and you know, both compatible at the same time, <laughs> you know. Man, I'm just glad to have you back, Scooter, to be honest. Yeah, I, I'm really glad to see you again. Right, so That's just me being honest. I promise you. Like, and this episode, it really showed. Like, they got to see the, just the full me. Not even the full me, but, you know, the me that or me. Like, I can go on, talk how I want to. You know, I don't got to just be. I can get to choose. I okay. get to choose. So, speaking of that, do you feel like you had a hard decision? Do I feel like I... I mean, my decision, it was hard though. I mean, but at the same time, I mean, you know, it went hard because at the time it's easy to decipher what it is that, you know, 
that is best available for you, you know, basically. So, I mean, it went hard, but it was hard, though, because, I mean, you know, time is everything. So, you know, if I would have had a little bit more time on some things, then, you know, we never know what, you know, I mean. <laughs> well, since time is everything, I think it's time to bring yeah. out the winner. Bam. Bam. Hey. I got it. Welcome back. Hi, Scooter. <laughs> oh, Scooter. Scooter, that's your shooter. Don't touch me. Uh, so, okay. So, hey, Bam. Welcome welcome back to Bam. How you doing? Hey, Bam. Hello. <laughs> okay, so why don't we want to be touched? Yeah. Oh, uh, you know, I'm just fancy on some days. I don't like to be touched. Mm. That's fair. You look great. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, that's the damn Bam. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, man. I don't want to be sad. Mm. So, obviously, how, I mean, let's go back. Let's it go. may not be obvious. What happened after Barry Boo? I mean, me and Scooter, we cool. We linked up once and we smoked, you know, smoked the house out. Okay. You know. And that was it. I invited him to my birthday key, but he didn't show up. Uh. He asked to take me out to eat. But when I hit him up, he didn't respond. So, you know, uh, <laughs> time waits for no one. Ooh. I moved it right on. Man, 0 for 2, Scooter. I need to reach it. <laughs> Scooter, do you have anything to say? You got, like, she invited you out. She was really trying to she do pursuing. something. Man, so, she, you know, all right. She did invite me. She did invite me to a little birthday deal. Little? And we, My little. No, I'm saying, I mean, Go come ahead. on, man, Proceed. come on, it's just the lingo, it's the lingo, you know yeah. what I mean, you know. Yeah, two. All right, two, she did, you know, we did smoke after, whatever, okay, cool, all right. If you just want to get technical, oh, Lord. Yeah, bro. <laughs> she did text me, she was like, okay, well, I'm having a birthday bash. I was gonna hit you up. I'm gonna hit you up and drop the ad. No, I sent you the invitation, the official okay, invitation. Okay, you know, okay. the whole okay. little shebang. Yeah. You got everything everybody That's, else got. Okay. But see, the difference between you and everybody else, they hit me up and like, hey, what's the address for tonight? I'm pulling up. Um, you didn't ever have any invitation. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Cool. Am I right or am I right? And boom. And, and that's you can and, and kid. That's fine. But if you tell me that you gonna personally drop the addy on me, you gonna say, yeah, I'm gonna send the address to Excuses. you. Like, shoot, what the hell is that excuse? excuse. How? Okay, How? so How? there's that a lot excuse. of excuses. Like, yeah. and, and a lot now, of Now, hold on, hold on, wait. Cause like, it, okay, so if you hit me up and say, you gonna drop the addy and you don't never drop, you say, I'm gonna drop the addy Thursday or whatever the date it is and you don't never drop it, then how is it on me? Like how? Because, like you told me, I show mouth or through a text message with your fingers really that you was I'm just saying though, like, but, come on, like, but the thing is, it ain't if I'm on me, somewhere, like, it's it ain't like, on me, okay. like, it ain't on me, so cause it's you know that, already, no, no, cause I'm, you know no, I already no, come you, full up you, you on everything. Do or you don't. I got a couple oh. vouchers. Yeah. <laughs> ain't no vouchers, nothing. Yeah. Um, yeah. I ain't taking nobody else in here. Hold on. Anywho. I think... There is a. Do you feel like you made the best decision? decision? I feel like. Never mind. Go ahead. Do I feel? I mean. Do I feel like I made the best decision? I had to ask myself that question. And bam. I wouldn't really care what decision he would have made because I move accordingly. All right. That sounds like right. me. That sounds like well, somebody. Cool. 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 Like, cool. It ain't no hard. No, they got a lot going on. <laughs> No, no, because it's busy, but you know, she's like, no, like, no, 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 all right, so welcome back, Bree. We're, we're really thankful to have you. Oh, thank you. Okay, yeah. so I I feel like you took your loss with grace, except for you kind of didn't come off like that on camera. <laughs> okay, so. Yeah, I'm just 
So, tell us how you felt. Um, I mean, it is what it is. If, if I'm in competition with somebody else, I mean, I'm gonna let you pick. So, I wasn't really tripping. I mean, he came back after the fact. That's probably what happened. <laughs> 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 so, 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 what happened with that? What happened? I mean, no. It's not that serious. Uh, it was, it's just friends. Like, we, we had an understanding of what it is and what it could have been, but. We just cordial, like we're we're cool. It's it's nothing that serious. It's, it's nothing right. serious at all. Okay, cool, cordial, and in between, I did see a little bit of static when I watched your guys' confessions. Did you watch them? I watched them, girl. Okay, and so I was shocked as hell. Okay, so tell us how you felt. Well, you know, I mean, I don't throw shade, and this is called for. But after watching my blue, my you know little green room episode and her, and I'm like, damn, what did I do with her? Because we exchanged numbers and everything before she left the building. But she said a comment like, oh, they deserve each other. I'm like, damn, what that mean? But you know, no hard feelings. I just taste shit and they roll off. Okay. How did you feel? Um, I definitely, I didn't even watch it, so um, I didn't, I don't know what was said or, but I do know what I said. Um, I don't know. I mean, I feel like. It is what it is. I, I took it as I see how he act and I see how she act and obviously they came together. So that's why I said they're meant for each other. Like I'm, I'm good. I'm in my own circle. It just felt like it wasn't meant for you. It, it definitely happen. wasn't meant for me. <laughs> it wasn't. It wasn't. Me either, girl. So, school. <laughs> school. Right. Tell us about your experience overall. All right, cool. All right. So I had a good time on the show, though. But I'm telling you, I mean, you know, you know, a pair of lips can say anything, you know. So yeah, as far as yeah, when I pick my bait, oh wait, well when I pick my bait, yeah, boom. After that, yeah, okay, we did, yeah, take a oh, boom. You went tone by then. You went home by now. I think it was the other way around. You went home. No, you went home by now. You I'm went home by now. Y'all, y'all stay tuned for the behind <laughs> <laughs> the scenes show. If I'm gonna say home by now, you went home by now. So, so go ahead, Rocky. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm, I'm back. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, you know, Miss Miss Bam Bam was on them scooters. I said I, the scooter challenge was live, man. The thing looked so fun. Uh, how did that go? I seen Bam won. And you I had a little stumble. I was like, I don't know how she won, but she down there blue. <laughs> <laughs> but so I was gonna be laughing like I'm always. I would have laughed, but see, that's that's, that's why I went tripping. I'm you, I mean, you ain't texting bro. back. See that type of shit right there. <laughs> 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 <Nah>. <laughs> I'm just messing with your school. You cool or whatever. You just be cool how you be cool. <laughs> Scooter, do you have any last words for Bam? I mean. I mean, sure. They don't know what it is, man. If 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 a motherfucker want to just make some work, they can make it work. If they exactly. Just, you know what I'm saying? Like it ain't even. I'm mean, you know what I'm saying? And you know what I'm saying? But at, at the same time, like go both ways. That person got a if They bullshit. Exactly. And then yeah. You know, <laughs> so I'm, just, you know, so I'll be, I'm just saying. I'll like be I mean. And look, she talking about how I be gay. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? See, females, they kind of have a hard time with just trying to address that they kind of, you know. I mean, but I mean, that. Like, you know, she, you know, let's let's, so, I mean, let's so, wrap it up. You know what I'm saying? Baby, school to a final. It was a crazy finale. It was. It was. It was definitely fun. It was. So, do you have any last words for Bam? That's Bree. Yeah, oh, Bree. Sh- yeah, so do you have any last words for Bree? <laughs> so, I mean, like I said, time is everything type shit. So I mean, you know, like they both want a challenge, you know. So that's a one and one. I mean, you really just can't pick off a tie. 
I mean, shit. In football, that ain't no record. It, don't nobody win. It's Basically, all, like, I mean, somebody got to win. It's tied. Like, so come school, on. Like, school don't want to go mean, on the you overtime. Know, hey, hey, you need the overtime. School, I mean, you need but, one more challenge. And then you're tied. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, you know, but, hey, that's how it go, though. Man. You can't have a tie. You know, you got to have a, you know. You gotta be able to choose. I feel like we should do my own episode because I was bamboozled. Oh, bam! Bamsy got bamboozled. Nah. <laughs> 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 All right. Because I just, feel, you know, you're cool, but you just, hey. you just on some bullshit. Season two, oh, Bam ain't putting and, up with and, no and, bullshit. And, <laughs> and, and, and that's <laughs> why I'm gonna be on season two. Me <laughs> too. <laughs> so, <laughs> so for real, hey, well, hey, 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 hey y'all go. Hey, nah, but man, so see, can we get fuck. a crowd response to see who who y'all feel should have won the finale episode? Give it up for Bam. One time for Bam. Okay, okay, okay. Let's give it up one time for Miss Bree. <laughs> I don't know, it sounds like the same to me. It's one and one. We need overtime. We need overtime. Well, man, I want to thank everybody for coming out. Thank you for tuning in and supporting season one of Bay or Boot. And you can follow us on all social medias at Bay or Boot DFW. And that's how it go down. <laughs> it does on Bay or Boot. I'm on the hunt